Ligue 1 leaders Lyon travelled to Stade Geoffrey Guichard on Sunday for a much anticipated derby against Saint Etienne. Leading scorer Pierre Emerick Aubameyang was back into the starting lineup for the hosts, while the visitors, still without captain Lissandro, started with Clément Grenier in the centre and Johan Gourcuff on the left. However, there was an early blow for Lyon and Grenier in particular, as he had to be substituted off after only 12 minutes with a thigh injury. Distress for the 21-year-old, who had clearly relished the opportunity to start the derby at the heart of Lyon's attack. He was replaced by Gaeta Fofana. There were precious few chances in a tense opening half, though the best of them fell to Lyon shortly after the half-hour mark. Alexandre Lacazette came forward and eventually found Bafatimbi Gomis, who slipped through to Anthony Revier. He got away from Fauzi Goulam and attempted to dink the ball over Stefan Ruffier, his attempt drifting just wide. Nil-nil at half-time. The next major incident arrived in the 56th minute when Max Alan Grudel fouled Mohamedou Dabo and appeared to catch him with his boot. An unimpressed Dabo responded with a headbutt that seemed to do a great deal of damage to Grudel. Little choice for Tony Chaperon given the gesture and Dabo was logically shown a red card. The replay suggests that Grudel perhaps caught Dabo in the face on purpose but, as even the greatest of footballers know, this kind of thing doesn't get you very far. into the 65th minute and 10-man Leon with a free kick 30 yards out. Michel Bastos stepped up and fired in a missile which got the better of Ruffier and put the visitors 1-0 up. Delight for the visiting Leon fans as Bastos claimed his first goal since returning from a two-month injury and his fourth of the season overall. A fine free kick with the trajectory of the ball catching Ruffier unawares. This was the first goal Saint-Étienne have conceded in over six hours of football. In the 74th minute, Renault Coad crossed into the Lyon area for Francois Clair, who attempted to turn and shoot on the half volley. His effort here wasn't far off at all. A few minutes later, from a Steve Malbronk corner, the ball came out to Fafana on the edge of the area. His shot took a deflection off Mustafa Bile, but Ruffier was quick to gather it ahead of Gomez. Bile almost catching his goalkeeper out here. Five minutes from time, Lever were themselves reduced to ten men after Alejandro Alonso went in dangerously on Samuel Umtiti. The game's second red card, though there can be little doubt about this one. In injury time, Saint Etienne came looking for an equaliser. Roman Hamuma got on the end of this free kick, but was adjudged to have handled the ball by the referee. Difficult to see from this angle, but the ball appears to have come off Hamuma's forearm rather than his head. Either way, Remy Vakutra managing to punch clear. 1-0 the final score. Leon stay top of Ligue 1, five points ahead of PSG.